Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Playing some more Borderlands 3 on the glorious PC. <coughs> so let's jump right in and continue on. Let's hunt. Whatever respite the Lodge provides you is only temporary. And while my beloved recovers, I will have to content myself with you. So let's play, Worm. Go to items. And they want to play with someone that has infinite dead bone. Okay, Mission update. I roughed up a local priest and he told me the Pearl of Ineffable Knowledge was last seen in a haunted shipwreck within the cavern of unmentionable sorrow. Wish me luck. Ooh, behind me. Oh no, I died. Oh, oh. Nice enemy design. I love it. I really do. Holy jeez, doodles. thinking why do I have the chains turned on? So I can see what enemies are. Yeah, I mean it's a double-edged sword, but Just so I can see where they're at without them hitting me now. Okay, got hold of that. I am your assignment. Yeah, I really need to do that. I don't know if you guys don't have to. I really don't. your drones out and I will keep popping them because yes. Or the loot chance. Even the loot. What does this thing do? No, I'll pass on that thing very much. Hey, I'm Gaddy. 
But please don't talk to me. Every time I speak, I have to... Uh, hold on. I have never experienced whatever happens, <coughs> but it looks most unpleasant. Now, where is Burton Briggs? Ah, damn it. You're talking to me. Okay, I think Burton was talking to Halan a while ago. There we go again. Thank you for your assistance. And now I leave you to your regurgitating. Oh yeah, sure thing. You're very welcome. Whoops, I spoke again. Wow. Ugh, screw this curse. Oops. <coughs> Holy crap! You scared the bequeezus out of me! What do you want? I hunt for Burton Briggs. But not to kill him, just to be clear. I'm gonna have a freaking heart attack at this rate! Look, I saw Burton with... What did you... Did you just... No? Okay. Saw Burton with Gina. Leave me alone, I'm... What was that? Nothing? I'm okay. I'm okay. Gina. I presume there is something super weird about you, too. Oh, piss off with all that. I don't need this right now. Or ever! Screw you! This all seems very uncalled for. Simply <coughs> tell me the whereabouts of Burton Briggs, and we can put this interaction behind us. Burton? That drunken moron who plays detective? Yeah, I know where he is. Told me he was going off to the freaking cemetery, like an idiot! Now get out of my face! Fine. Also, I suggest you try meditating. Morons! Everyone's morons! And I'm so angry about it! Ah, damn it! <clears throat> okay. <clears throat>
Still better. And we got one more over here. Oh no 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 no! Come on, come on. Damn fridge! Why do you pop? So Good God, dude. Boy, I know why it is. It's an apartment. No, I, I, I want to roast my, my mechanical jewels. Hold up. Damn it. Hold on, no. I want to Come on. Yes. Yeah. Roast my mechanical nuts. The pack leaves no one behind. Glad to see the life back in you. <coughs> Hey, uh, you really saved my ass, friend. Thank you. Now, uh, what's eyes. I doing here again? Oh, right. I almost forgot that I can't remember anything. It's my curse. Name's Burton. Burton Briggs. But I think I go by Bert. Well, let's try it out. Call me Bert. Greetings, Bert. 
No, that's not right. Burton it is. So, what's your story, friend? I must release my friend from the grip of a cursed ring. I seek to know its nature. Cursed ring? Hmm. I've got a hunch it's got something to do with those bonded. And I always follow my hunches. I think. But if it's the bonded you're investigating, you should head to the town archives. Here, he should get you in. My way of saying thanks. As for me, I can't remember what the six and a half hells I was doing here, so I'll head back to the old lonesome shop. Alright, so they can't remember anything in this perspective. Now that right. we're working together, here's a completely unsolicited <sighs> monologue about my life. No, that's okay. You don't have to. It all started with... Well, I'm not sure. I'm a man without memories. There's just a cloud of dark fog in their place. But I know I was just between us, Vault Hunter. I feared this weekend wouldn't have enough excitement, but... Now we are embroiled in the cult secrets. Diabolical curses of great big monsters. Where they could all be streamed up. I'm still wrestling with this mystery. I really don't know whether I go by birth. Still on the lookout for a better gun. Better this thing. Actually, is this the back of the It is. I don't need you at all. Get out. I don't want you at all, dude. No. No thanks. Dust Bound Archives. Welcome back, my girl. The archives keep strange, unknowable hours. Mostly because they're not posted anywhere. The only way in is through the old librarian, Harriet. A handy trick. Did that say how much it got me? Alright, Greetings. I require entry into the archives. It is of dire consequence. Would you keep your voice down? This is a place of quiet learning and solemn contemplation. Hey, Harriet. Let them in, won't you? I helped you find that missing locket, didn't I? Oh, fine. But don't you cause a ruckus, you hear me? And this makes us even, Bert. Why that work? I wasn't sure if that locket bit was true. Now, you'll want to make your way to the holography room to find what you're searching for. The holoprojector will have some info on the town's history. I see you delving into my past, Worm. Oh, you are tenacious, aren't you? <laughs> I haven't had a play.
Day one. My name is Eleanor Olmsted. My beloved and I have arrived on the rim world of Xylorgos. We have finally found the beast of legend after years of chasing its name across the stars. Gideon. Supposedly it means eater of hearts, but the original language is dead and lost to time. A charming introduction as ever, Vincent, my love. Gideon's physiology can only be described as otherworldly. Though its body is dead, its heart still beats. This requires further study. Who knows what xenobiological revelations it has for us? This is the start of a whole new life for us, my darling. Right, right. The founders. Vincent and Eleanor Olmstead. Uh, you'll find more holotapes around the archives. Uh, I'm guessing. I'll let you handle this bit. You'll have to excuse me for a moment. Uh, I must be stoically pensive. If I were the old citizen, I'd hide my past where no these citizens wouldn't happen across it. Okay, let's do this.
Alright, they are just way too tanky. Yeah, that was really too tanky. I want to do... I want to do this. Way, way, way too tanky for me. Ready to go? Alright, let's try it again. Let the hunt take you! If I get a better gun, I don't have any elemental power. Go with this. Go with you, death. One's better. Oh my god, yes. And what are our... Oh, enemy head size. Ooh, I that shit is... No, it's a lot, actually. It's a lot. Um... <coughs> no. 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 That works. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put a cut here and I will come back with some more. If you guys enjoy the content, please feel free to subscribe, like, and hit the bell. Have a good day, guys.